All right, guys, welcome to round one of this community draft. Um, we're playing against someone who's not in the community, which is fine. Yep, Santa Clance. Uh, Santa Clance, shout <laughs> out to you. That actually really rolls off the tongue very well. It's a nice name. I it like feels it. good. Uh, we're definitely playing first. Let's play first. That feels good. Yep. Uh, I mean, well... We don't do anything until turn two. We don't do which anything until turn three. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean... Uh, is this keepable? Well... What if he's aggro, you know what I'm saying? He's definitely aggro, I mean... <laughs> I mean, we have Spectacle for eventuality, but it's like... And Gift helps us get back in eventually. You know what? Let's keep Let's it. Let's keep it. We have a cycle card. Exactly. Wish you all luck. Indeed. Yeah, Prism's pretty good on the play, right? Because you don't yeah. get as punished. And he's playing blue anyway, so... What? Simic for sure. Oh, there's our fourth land... So, oh, yeah, we, we were hitting that for sure. Let's just, just drop Swamp. Yeah. The only reason I might go against the Swamp is in case we go, like, Forest Island. No, actually, we, we don't need it. We have a it. Prism. Well, now we can Sprite crisis. next turn. Sweet. Yeah. Now we have we're a Play fine. next turn. We were always fine. That's under question. Yeah, he's Simic. So he's probably got a... Simic? Oh, no, Shamble Shark. Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Which well, won't make a difference. Because we are going to Sprite away. We pump it, too. Indeed. No, he didn't have it. Wow. That's actually sweet. Maybe, every, again, maybe everyone was fighting. But he could have semi. Croc, right? Oh. oh. Oh, I love this guy. <laughs> I love this man. Do we just go last we thoughts here? I think we just go last yeah. thoughts. We start Let's draw cards. two extra cards. Yep. More extra cards to draw there. Draw a card. That's a sweet card to draw. Cipher on. That's swing skis. And draw so the card. It was at very least an inspiration. Which isn't the worst. No. Nope. And it might be more than that. As soon as we draw three cards, I'm super happy about it. Yes. Oh, yeah. I mean, if... Huh. Yeah, we're getting there. Because now we can extort off it. If we draw a land... <laughs> oh, this is my... This if might we be draw a land, we can extort off it next turn. Unless he, draws, he drops a croc, but... No, the thing he, is, he, he can... If he crocs, we kill the croc for sure. With spectacle, you mean? Oh, God. Oh, yes. yeah, for sure. I agree with that. He's gonna, he's but if he just drops a ground stuff. guy, I, we I say we drop an enforcer. Yeah. If we draw a land, I don't like. Otherwise, maybe it's just sure. spy. Okay, sure. Your turn. Okay. So um, yeah, that's fine if that's your turn. Yeah. So it was just don't have a two drop. But shell shark. Oh okay. Oh yeah. He had an extra mana. Um, you know what? That wasn't too bad. That's not bad. We still got our inspiration and delta damage. Yeah. That's not awful. Sweet. Um. Enforce. Yeah, let's enforce. Leaving one mana of any color open. Yeah. Yeah. We should have picked up that mugging. Well, this is what I was trying to say when that um, Wrecking Order was there is like, we have two prisms. We can play yeah. whatever we want. Oh, for sure, but I don't know. Like, uh, I'm, I'm glad we stayed more on color. Because if we, if we don't. Okay. Blockade's fine. If we don't draw the uh, the prisms, we just have a even more junky deck. Oh, no, Chef's Lace. Nice um, so let's just go Spy. Spy, Prism. Oh. Or do we do we Gift? Gift. Do we Gift Extort Swing? Uh, I'd rather make our board presence a little better. We well, can Gift he, next turn, right? He has no board. Okay, fine. I'll accept it. I also kind of want to play the Enforcer for Double Extort. Plus, uh, that if we even get there, right? We're gonna get there. We should have made that white mana, just so we could use the prism. <laughs> Let's see what we mill. It should be sweet too, because the prism uh, actually gives a haven in a pit fight. Oh, I love this guy. Um, I think I wanted them to draw that haven. Well, it depends what's in his hand. I guess he might just have that like huge cards in his hand. Yeah. No, you don't want you don't want the Verdant Haven player to draw Verdant Havens. They always have a reason. Right, right. Unless they're just playing a weak deck, right? Maybe he's just yeah. having fun. I like but if he casts something big, we have instant removal for yeah. it. I like how that that perfect prism is going to be two extort triggers. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Eh? And draws <laughs> us a card. Yeah. Like, that's what it does. Deal two damage, gain two life, draw a card for, two, for four mana. Yeah. Yeah, I'd play that card. Yeah, I'd play that card yeah. all day. <laughs> we're, play <laughs> we're playing, like, last thoughts. Of course we play that card. The question is, do we just gift next, deal him five, and then shadow next turn? Shadow slice next turn? 
I want to. I want to. Because then that deals him another six, another five. Like that puts him so low on health points. Yeah. Well, I don't even know what he's planning on doing. Yeah. I want to start setting up the extort plan. To be honest. It's just that if he's playing Verdant Havens, it, I feel like I he, feel like he's ramping into something big, right? I feel like he probably has a lot of removal too, though, right? Like, yeah, maybe. I don't want to. I don't want to put all our eggs in one basket. Well, it won't be. Shadow Slice will go on Spy. Gift will go on Enforcer. Well, let's just see what he casts. We're probably just casting Spectacle here, I imagine. Yeah, we'll just hold on to that unless it's something big. Yeah, sure. Like we can still get through in the air, right? Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Okay, so now that that probably we'll no longer the do the double exorb plan. We'll he do... shouldn't have done that on his turn. I personally don't think he should have done that on right. his turn. No, for sure. Uh, we could have Psychic Strike in our deck, but I mean, we can make him feel really bad about it and play another one. Uh, I think this not is... that that's awesome. Like the best thing to do no. necessarily. I what like... is the best thing to do? I feel like at this point, Shadow Slice would be a good play because he might not have more removal. And if he does, like, I mean, you can't have infinite removal. Well, if he has removal in his hand, that means his hand's like. Oh, jeez. Broker. Um, one, two, one, two, three. Well, we can prism and broker and hit for two. If, okay, how about Let's this? do that. If, if we're not if we're not shadow slicing that ballast rage by, like... We will. Okay. Like, it's still a, a five mana, six damage spell, right? Yeah. As um, long as we keep that spy in play, right? So do you think this is a good idea? Prism and broker? I kind of like the shadow slice, to be honest. I feel like if... Okay. He's tapped out, so... Yeah. It's a good opportunity to get six extra damage, and maybe it just takes the game. Right. Because, like, the Shadow Slice Slice plan is the only plan that relies on a specific card to work. Right. So... Now, we're going to feel silly if he has removal here. But we still... No, because we we deal eight, and that means half his hand was just the removal. Yeah. And we just go with... And we still have a Grizzly Spectacle. Yeah, and we still have plans. Why is that way over there? And actually, we go Syndicate Enforcer next turn, and then we can extort off our Shadow Slice. Sure. Dealing yeah. five, six damage to him, taking him down to six, threatening lethal the next turn. Right. I like, it. I like where we're at right now. Because even if he plays a big dude... We kill it. We kill we, it. Even if he plays... Okay, even if he plays two big dudes, like, I'm not... We're, we're still winning the race. Yeah. Is what I'm getting at. Like, he has Yeah, to he's play. playing something big. Nimbus? Yep. Ooh, call shot. I'm really glad I got to call a shot... On this video. <laughs> it, feels, it feels like a video I have to prove myself. <laughs> that Nimbus would have been fine. I would have played that over a Drake Queen Crassus in our deck any day. Speak ah, speaking of the of devil. Um, but we're just going to spectacle here. I mean, we could prism and hope we draw a land, but no. I think that's a little risky. Yeah. So let's just spectacle. And if he could have killed our Spidey... No, nah, he would have just cast a Swimmer anyway. Mill 5. We get to see more of his deck. Oh, yeah. he conceded the match? He conceded the whole match. He's left the game. No, he conceded the whole match. No, that's what I mean. Like, if, I, I think he just like actually picked up his cards and went home. <laughs> huh, that's too bad. We just made someone rage quit with a grizzly spectacle, and a, he must have just had no more answers for balustrade spy. I don't understand. He had no more answers for balustrade spy into the next game as well. He just quit the match. Maybe he misclicked. Maybe he didn't mean to concede the whole match. Maybe he needed to do something. I don't, I don't know, know, but we won round one, so... We will take it? Um, yeah, I guess um, we'll take it. <laughs> so uh, stay tuned for round two when we name this deck. Yes. When we finally come up with a name for the deck.